uh, guys, sorry for, for my stupid voice, but it's day three of Rock am Ring, therefore it was a good festival film so far. <laughs> good. How are you? Good. Yeah? Yeah. yeah you too? That's, that's your my, my microphone. Okay. And um, first of all, please introduce yourself to our viewers here, to the audience. Who are you? What's, what's the band name? And something like that. I'm Andy. And this is? I'm Tyler. Yeah. And we're from a band called Diarder's Murder. Perfect. And it's cool that you're here. Thank you very much. I'm, I'm honored. How was uh, Rock and Park so far? Rock and Park was pretty sick. It was a lot bigger than I was expecting it, expecting it to be. Um, yeah, that was definitely it was uh, the biggest show that I've ever played. Really? And it was, okay. it was, like, it was uh, awesome to get to play with a bunch of other huge bands that I've enjoyed over the years. So it was pretty sick. So you like the lineup of Rock and, uh, Rock, and Ring, Rock and Park? Yeah. 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 Are there any bands which are playing on these festivals who say, okay, this is these uh, heroes from for, for our career, or I don't know? Well, Tyler got to meet Winston from Parkway yesterday, so... Yeah, I got to meet Winston for the first time okay, yesterday, and uh, um, I listened to... I used to listen to Parkway a lot, a lot back in the day, probably back in, like, 2000, 2010. Yeah, okay, and it was, yeah, then it's really cool Yeah. to have that opportunity. Yeah, course. and it was real. It was a, it was a, I, I said yesterday on my Instagram that it was a historic moment in my musical career okay, cool. lore oh, for cool, for me to, to meet to meet him so it was pretty awesome do you have some some personal influences for your music we we'll say hey this is my all-time favorite band no no nothing we have like a collection that i think have defined the sound of the band yeah over time and then we just kind of go with it after that okay so obviously bands like decapitated behemoth parkway drive kill switch engage yeah. Makes bury sense. it, bury your dead. Um, a lot of bands that job for a cowboy, bringing uh, mosh influences, yeah, death see. metal, yeah, with sure. the classical songwriting and of metalcore. Yeah. And we just kind of did that, and now it's been so long that we just keep going off on our own. Uh, bands from the festival, or just bands in general? No, no, in general. Um, I'd say the main person that influences me the most, and with vocals is probably, I would say at this point, is Ben Doerr from Shadow Intent. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Yes. Um, I, I looked also, like, also coming up as a, a vocalist. I used to I used to play guitar in most of the bands that I was in, and then I finally switched over to being uh, okay. a vocalist. And then once I started doing that, I was listening to a lot of Fit for a King, and then I started getting into heavier territory, and then I... Uh, and then I looked up to uh, Joe from Fit for an Autopsy for quite a long time. And then as I kept delving deeper and deeper into the, the death metal world, um, I found Ben from Shadow of Intent. And like he's really cool. influenced me a lot to go heavier with my lows and higher with my highs and like to explore like black metal vocal territory and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So, in my opinion, I think that he is he is like the sickest metal vocalist. I am happy for you that you found your place yeah, as, as, as a singer and not as a guitarist anymore. So, <laughs> that, is, yeah. that is cool. <laughs> like that. Um, I've got a can here. Uh, can you see the can? The, yep. the, the, um, you want me to grab it? Question, yeah, please grab it. There are questions on it generated from AI, so they are stupid. Uh, Maybe they are a bit rude, I don't know. Maybe they are super boring. Give it a shot then. <laughs> Who's going first? You're going first. Oh shit, I think I got probably the worst question. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. If you had to kick one member out of the band, who would it be and why? <laughs> I don't know. I've been in the I've been in the band the least amount of time out of everybody. I've like, like less than a year, so I don't know if I have the right to answer this question. Do you want to do this, this question? Would, this would be a crazy question if it got asked a year ago. Right? That's yeah. for sure. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Let's go to a new question. Yeah. yeah can, nice I, can I pick? A, can I pick another question? Yeah, sure. Because yeah, I, I wouldn't want to kick anybody out. Yeah. Okay. It is. An What's answer. your guilty pleasure song that you're embarrassed to admit you like? I got two. Well, they're not that guilty. I. Don't that's even a good care. question. Love Shack, B-52s. Yeah, but that's a good, good tune. It's a great song. Yeah. And Deutschland Love. by Ramstein. Yeah. My most listened to song on Spotify really? every year yeah. since it came out. Can I answer that question too? Please. I would pick uh, Forever Isn't Long Enough by Michael Bolton. Okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 He was my, uh, he, was my feelings, yeah. he was my number one listened to artist on Spotify for two years in a row. 
Oh my goodness. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's cool. That one probably should have stayed yeah. in the vault. That was a good question. <laughs> good answer. You, you want a new question? Yeah, let me do another one. I don't want to kick uh, anybody out. I don't have the right to kick anybody out. Yeah, yeah. Maybe the next one is better. Maybe not. <laughs> How do you feel about critics saying your latest album is just a rehash of your old stuff? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck them. <laughs> Um, I can say this as being a being a fan of the band before I was actually in the band. This album is actually much different than the last two albums. Yeah. Or last three albums. He's got whatever. An it's, of perspective. It's yeah. yeah. It's 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 way different. I don't know why people feel the need to say something like this just because they. I think. That is a rude German attitude to ask bullshit <laughs> questions. I under I can understand that people in the death core, death metal world have their things that they like and they always want to hear. Yeah. But and like when bands try to do something different or outside of what's it's, it's what they show. have been doing. Oh yeah. Um, you some make people, an album that sounds like an evolution. They go, oh, they sound the same. And then you do something that is a little bit change and they go oh they lost uh, their sound yeah, it's total bs <laughs> anytime there's something different that happens people have something to say yes. about it but it doesn't really matter how good your album is or how bad your album is someone is going to have something to say about it I so think that the thing it is what it is with music in general not yeah. only that's, that's metal or that's cool yeah but i can say i can say that this as a as a fan before being in the band that this album is 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 very good in my in my opinion in my very good opinion, is it yeah. your, is it your favorite um oh, good question yeah Oh, yeah, true answer. True answer. Um, no. <laughs> either this one or um. Oh, good, good. Oh. Go turn around. Go turn around. Good turn around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Recovery. Yeah. <laughs> Biggest recovery. See, now we're being judged this by critics this one from or inside or the band. This one or uh, or Dear Desolation. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I thought he was gonna go with Hate or Holy War. So. Yeah. Holy War's got some good ones on it, but I, I like I like Dear Desolation a lot. I think one question in the in the can is. Uh, do you regret writing a particular song? Is there is there one? Is there one track? No, I don't think so. Yeah. I think sometimes. Well, I know for sure in my experience, you have to finish the song, or I have to finish the song, have it be finished before you're ready to move on to the next one. Yeah. Otherwise, the idea stays in your mind, and you have to release it. To, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Otherwise, it kind of haunts you. So. Sure. You have sometimes you just have to get it finished and put it out and go whatever next one. Let's go. Yeah, good, good answer. Uh, guys, I'm coming from a video game related station and therefore my question is, do you play video games? Yep. Yep. Every night before I go to bed. Really? Yep. What kind of games? Warzone. Ro Warzone, Call of Duty, okay, cool. Yep. Yeah, I love that. Uh, <laughs> we, we, we cannot play Warzone here, but uh, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe uh, Modern Combat or Street Fighter games like that. And what is uh, with you? I'm more into like the the big like fantasy open world kind of games. Um, like the latest game that I've been trying to play is um, well before we left was Dragon Dragon's Dogma Two. Yeah. And then I was like I was like well since I can't play it I will yeah. the first one is is available to buy on Switch so I got it for my Switch yeah. and I've been trying to to play it. But I was a big fan of Skyrim and, and Fallout. Have you tried ba uh, Baldur's Gate? No, I haven't. That's I haven't tried to do one. that now. It's a really great one, but it's a time killer. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah I don't. Yeah. yeah, you should try it. It's, it's cool. Yeah. But hey, let's let's fight then. I would say um, you both fight each other. Oh damn! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it Mortal Kombat? Yeah, sure it is. My dad was weirdly good at the very first one that came out on on Super Nintendo, and he actually beat it. And I have no idea how he did that. <laughs> I could, I could never do it. Props to your dad then. Are you sub zero? Yep. Oh. <laughs> um, oh man, I don't know who any of these. Yeah. Goro. Yeah. And Goro. The boss from the first one. Against <laughs> his new guy. <laughs> the blessings. Against like, a new guy and I don't know. Yeah, choose a sure. area. And then I hope it's the first uh, modern Let's fight. Let's uh, do uh, it. <laughs> I, I hope yeah, I mean, uh, maybe we should have got Mortal Kombat on that. What? Hey, Xbox, this is this a cutscene? Yeah, yeah. No, it's a bunch of stuff. Okay, fine. Oh. Uh, yeah, uh, I, I see. I think. I see spikes. 
Oh. <laughs> All the jumping. So what is what is this caveman doing there? This is a little bit odd. <laughs> hey. I mean, maybe, maybe we need some sound. <laughs> I don't remember any of the moves. Yeah, but now it's better. No. We... No. <laughs> no. I'm no, really, no, 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 no. I'm just back here pressing buttons. I'm not doing it. Um, Fatal blow. What does it mean? I don't know. I just knew this. Oh, <laughs> that's cheesy. No. That is cheesy. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. Biggest. No! Oh, oh, Omni Man, yeah. Best of three, of course. Therefore, round two. Fight. <laughs> oh my god, every time I let go of my block, it's when you yeah. still keep going. True. Oh no. Oh, that's the biggest comeback in this story. Oh, I see, I see. We'll see if I can figure this out. I see. Okay. All right. Not All right. bad. We are so back, <laughs> baby. It's embarrassing. Final round. Maybe you need to push oh. things harder. Punch in the ground. Yeah. That's on me, man. Super skill. <laughs> To fight soil. <laughs> oh dang! Yeah, that was cool. No, I'm pinned now. Oh no! 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 Oh. No! 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 Oh! The dead. Oh shit! Sick. Nope. Oh god! <laughs> What's no. going on there? What is going on? Nope. Oh, oh! Congratulations! Fatality! I don't know. That, that was your fatality. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's lifting. People lifting are rocks. gonna watch it and be like, that was the most boring match of Mortal Kombat. <laughs> <of it." laughs> I'm pretty sure that it is. <laughs> hey, but at least I had fun. What about you? I mean, you know, maybe we'll get it on the bus now, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, fall interviews. Avenge great. myself. It is okay. Yeah, it is okay. Hey, guys, thank you very much. Hope Thank you for having us. Yeah, of, of course. course. Um, have, do you have something to say for the German viewers here? Last, or last words or you? I don't know. Give the shot. Mm, nah. Yeah. Just have a good time. <laughs> don't worry. Good time. Don't worry so much about. Uh, we like know. German beer. And, uh, Just have a good time. We're gonna drink it. <laughs> Perfect. All the best. <laughs> have a great show yeah. later. Then, Thank uh? you. Okay, Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Ihr habt gedacht, das Video ist schon vorbei, was? Nein, nein, ich wollte es nicht versäumen, noch einmal Danke zu sagen. Danke an Dreamhouse, bzw. die Veranstalter vom Rock am Ring, dass ich mit meinem Sprinter vor Ort stehen durfte und dort wieder ein bisschen Schabernack machen durfte. Danke an die Künstlerinnen und Künstler, die bei mir im Bus saßen. Wir hatten wunderbare Gespräche, wir haben toll gezockt. Und danke an dich, dass du dieses Video geschaut hast, trotz meiner Heiserkeit. Aber so ist es nun mal, ich kann dann ja auch nicht halblang machen, ihr wisst es ja. Ich würde mich sehr freuen, wenn ihr einen Daumen nach oben da lassen würdet und vielleicht hier unten in den Kommentaren einen kleinen Text da lassen könntet. Das würde mir viel bedeuten, würde mich sehr freuen. Und nicht zuletzt möchte ich mich bei meinem wunderbaren Technikpartner, Achtung, Werbung, Asus bedanken, für die Bereitstellung dieses Severus G14 Notebooks. Wir hatten damit sehr viel Spaß. Alle haben es gefeiert. Es ist ein Gaming Notebook mit richtig viel Power. Ihr seht schon dieses 120 Hertz Display, was überhaupt nicht flimmert und nice ist. Auf der Rückseite ist diese geile Slash Bar. Es ist eine RTX 4070 von Nvidia verbaut und ein AMD Risen 9 Prozessor. Also Gaming Power pur. Hat uns nicht enttäuscht. Die Leute waren happy. Und wenn ihr mehr über dieses wunderbare Gerät erfahrt, fahren wollt, dann klickt gerne hier unten in die Videobeschreibung einmal rein. Wird mir auch viel bedeuten. Das war's jetzt aber. Bis zum nächsten Video. Euer Krogi.